So why should someone consider joining all of us? You should consider joining because, as I mentioned, you will give a bio sample and also your health data. Then they will enter all that data and you everything you've done, you're going to get it back. They're going to give you, say, a, a large snapshot of your health. Also, you will be able to see what am I at risk for? And when they get your bio sample, now we know something about your DNA, your genetic data. And genetic counselors will be available to answer questions that you have uh, because now they see how you're living, your lifestyle, and now they have your DNA and they can even give you more information. And one thing I want to add on that as well is that, as you all know, everybody that goes, you go for your annual visit. Sometimes annual visit, it just gives you like a small snapshot. Hope I'm telling this right. With the All of Us program, it's giving you an overview of some things that the doctor can't even see because you got all these. I'm amazed at how many actual researchers are actually looking at all this data and also the different type of, um, I guess I want to make this right, genetic factors that they're looking at, like 53 matching or uh, that number 53 just comes in my head of, of something that they're basing your data upon. It's give you a genetic match for it. Right. And that genetic data will let you know what you at risk for. And, you know, we all should be trying, excuse me, trying to live healthy. So it's a reminder also, okay, I need to get checked. I know I'm at risk for this. I need to keep up with it. So, I mean, I tell everybody, you need to consider joining all of us. Okay, one thing I want to go back to earlier, you was mentioning about health disparities, disparities, mm -hmm. um, mainly, especially in the minority community. Can you talk a little bit more about that? And why that's been such a big issue over the last couple of years, or really, I guess, decades? Sure. For example, when you look at various cancers, a person of color is at a high risk of mortality. Mm -hmm. Now, you look at a white in individual, they may have a higher incident rate, but they don't have that, say, high mortality rate that we as people of color. So that's why health disparities uh, research is so important because the numbers are disproportionate and we need more people of color to participate in various you know, research programs. But we also have to look at history because it impacts our thinking of if we're gonna participate or if we won't participate. So we know um, there have been some prejudices, some discrimination, mm -hmm. but here at UAB, we really want to make a difference. And then if you see something that's not right, let us know because we do want to improve. And one thing as well, like me actually going through the program, I always like, because one of the mm -hmm. things before, um, at the beginning, you know, as you all been watching throughout this whole year is, I didn't want to just, talk about this program, I actually want to go through it myself to kind of see that it's very eye-opening that they even tell you about your genetic uh, DNA, what well, genetic history, where you come from. They do, uh, yes. You may assume it's like, okay, well, I'm African-American, I come from Africa, but there's different parts of Africa that you're from. Yes, and you and can see, you know, the, the different percentages, yes. Birmingham app today on Android, iPhone, and iPad for free. Get info on everything you need to know about local news, events, businesses, restaurants, and more. Visit our website, whatshappeningbham.com, or follow us on social media at Happening Beham for more information. Download the What's Happening Birmingham app today, your source for everything Birmingham.